Ball fans trying to snap a 15 game losing streak to Alabama. The last time Big Orange was in the win column back in 2006. They're ahead right now, a sellout crowd of more than 100,000 inside Neyland. One ticket to this one, $400 or close to it. But lots of fans are watching for free on campus. We check in first with 10 News anchor Katie Inman. She joins us live from the scene to set the mood. Hey, Katie. Hey, John. I'm here at Ball Village, which is in the shadow of Neyland Stadium. There are hundreds of ball fans here. You can see behind me, it's just a sea of orange, and it's full of nervous energy as well. I also want to show you a few of the cutest ball fans that are here. Come on in, guys. We have got uh, three guys here. We've got Lane. Lane, how, how excited have you been today? What's today been like? Football. <laughs> Football. And what, what has today been like for you? Great. I've been having a good time with my brothers and been having a good time watching the Tennessee game. What will it be like if Tennessee beats Alabama? It will be exciting because we will be in the top three. I mean in the top four. So have you guys had a lot of fun today? Lane is super excited. Yes. <laughs> and they told me, I mean, what are you wanting to be when y'all grow up? A football player. So maybe we'll see them on the Vols team. I don't want to leave out little Silas down here. He's three. He's got the right shirt on today. How are you feeling today, Silas? <laughs> that that pretty much explains it. Thank you all for being here with me, talking with me a little bit. Some of the cutest Vol fans, like I said, here at Vol Village, and the excitement is building. It's kind of funny because here in the shadow of Neyland Stadium, you know, they'll hear the fireworks go off for those touchdowns first, and then they'll hear the delay here on the screen, on the big screen behind me. But it's kind of it's kind of funny because for a usual game, everyone is just super excited. But this one, people are being a little more quiet than usual. Mm -hmm. I think everyone's sitting with their nervous energy. They're not wanting to say anything that might jinx anything. Mm -hmm. So, John, it's a really, really fun out here. But I will say the energy on campus is a little different than normal. Yes, indeed, Katie, and good reason as well. It's tied 28 as we're in the third quarter now. You can see knotted as we're counting down to hopefully what will be a Vol victory for volunteer fans. It's a tight one in Neyland.